a story as to why I was trapped in the closet at work today. And by trapped, I mean I willingly hid myself in the closet. So this morning, Mr. Administrator, I'm not going to say the name, Mr. Administrator was walking by and it's like, hey, we need some coverage for some teachers that are out. So I'm going to come find you later. To which I respond, no, you ain't. And I went to go take my sandwich and stuff to the teacher's lounge because, you know, I want my stuff to be cold for lunchtime. In the meantime, you know, I go talk to my coworker friends living my best life, trying to hide, waste time until 8 o'clock in here because if he can't find me by 8 o'clock, then I ain't finna cover. But by then, my homie had a meeting because she broke the gate to get into the school, so she had to go so I couldn't stand in her room. So then, I go back to Miss W's room, right? So I'm in Mrs. W's room, and I'm like, yo, I'm going to hide in your closet. And she's like, haven't you been in the closet before? Why are you trying to go back? And I'm like, I'm not trying to cover, so I'm going to hide in this closet. So I go in her closet, and I leave the door cracked a little bit. And I'm like, if he come in here, he ain't going to know where I'm at because my ass in the closet, period, point blank. Like, you're not going to have me covered. So next thing I know, I hear his voice coming up the hallway. And I'm like, oh, no, he's coming. Mind you, I'm still in the closet. I see one of my students realize that, oh, snaps, Mr. Administrator's here, let me save Miss Carter. So she slowly backs up into the closet door to pretty much close it officially. So at this point, the closet is closed, and I'm just in there like, with my phone out, trying to text people like, bruh, I'm legit in a closet right now, so I don't have to cover. Like, this is real life. I'm not fenced. So the whole time, Mr. Administrator is talking to Mrs. W and Mr. A about who going to cover such and such as classes. Mrs. W was like, can't you just disperse the kids? Like, we got things to do. And by things to do, she means our daily Starbucks. And sometimes they go to Chick-fil-A get themselves some breakfast. And so, like, you can't interfere with that team camaraderie. Whole time, I'm still in the closet taking pictures like, bro, there's a light outside. I, it's dark. I'm trapped. This is low-key terrifying. I low-key couldn't breathe. That closet was kind of cramped. Tell me why Mr. Administrator was legit talking to them for five to seven minutes. I was in this whole closet for five to seven minutes, like dying, gasping for air, just because I did not want to cover nobody's class. But like I said before, this is real life, period. He finally leaves, and I come out the closet, and Mrs. W was like, I can't believe you just did that. And I'm like... And she's laughing at me, and I'm explaining to her, like, Miss, I was not about to cover. I'm over it. If I have to hide, I told her, like, if I have to hide in your classroom every first period on a B-Day and hide in your closet, then so be it. I'm going to hide in your closet. So then afterwards, we went to Starbucks slash Chick-fil-A, and we didn't get back to campus at, like, 9 o'clock, 9.15. And then I'm sitting in her room. Mr. Administrator walked by. He just looks at me and shakes his head. I'm like, I told you you wasn't going to find me. Like, you thought I was playing? Like, I'm a master finesse. Like, if I got to hide in the ladies' restroom for the whole first period so I don't have to cover, then I'm going to hide in the ladies' restroom for the first, first, for the first, first, for the first period. Like, I can't even get my words out. Like, this is, this is not a game. Like, I barely want to teach my own classes, let alone somebody else's. Like, you don't pay me to babysit. And I got to fill out a form. Nah, it's not going to work for me. So that's the story of why.